Good. All right, Coach Brooks. Uh, lost the first series of the season uh, over the weekend, but, like, there were still bright spots there. Like, he had 23 uh, runs on the first game on Saturday. Um, <clears throat> really battled back on the game on Sunday. I think at one point y'all were down 9-1 to one, uh, in the sixth before you ended up making that one uh, loss in that one by 11-9. to nine. But g- give me your overall thoughts on, on the guys' performance. Well, I think the first thing, time for moral victories is over. Um, we're past that, um, you know. Having said that, I um, feel a lot better. I um, feel a lot better after this weekend than last. Um, you know, I thought we competed really hard. Um, you know, obviously it's not a recipe for success to put yourself uh, down six to eight runs uh, against a really good team. So, you know, the game we won 24 down, that game six nothing. So, you know, um, that was sort of a consistent pattern. Um, we did not pitch well um, this weekend, so that was disappointing. Offensively, though, we were much better. Um, we still, you know, we just uh, we got to do a better job scoring runs. Even though, you know, like I could say you look at the the numbers and what it says over the course of a season, um, we should be in good shape. You know, we we lead the conference in in run scored. We're second or third in runs allowed best fielding team. Um, so all those things tend to, over the course of a large sampling, um, lend to good results. So, um, you know, but like I said, we got to start doing the results. And, and really it just comes down to one or two plays a game um, that we are not making, you know, that we've got to make. And so feel like uh, all those things are correctable. I really feel like we're getting ready to get on a roll. Um, here and so uh, like to do that starting Wednesday. So it's a it's a long season, of course. Yeah. Um, but have you have y'all have you specifically and I guess the team as a whole gotten to the point where you know what what that what that roster is going to be like like because consistent lineup is going to be like th- throughout the the, the no, conference I mean, play. We're missing you know our number one pitcher didn't throw this weekend and we're missing two All Americans <laughs> so. No, um, you know, and that's the thing. It affects you. I've never been through a season as a coach, though, with where you don't have injuries. So, you you know, as a coach, you, you need to prepare your roster. And, man, how great. I wish I could sit here and say, well, you know, those guys are out. We can't do some of the things we'd like to do without that personnel. Um, however, the people that have stepped in have done great at what they do. And so it – that's not the reason we're losing. We're losing because we're not playing good enough. It's not missing people. It's not any of that. Um, and so we got to coach better, um, and then we got to just go execute better in key situations. And um, you know, it, it's it's so weird. And we'll see how when we look back at this thing um, on, on where we're at. But you know, this obviously is adversity. Um, nothing good in my life has ever come from some things going good. So this is an awesome opportunity. I, I'm fired up and ready to go, and our guys are too. And you have a midweek game at home before you, you hit the road. What, what, what do you, besides just, you know, we want to win, uh, right. what, what else do you expect to see from your, your, your team uh, specifically on Wednesday? Well, get, get a lot of different dudes that maybe haven't gotten their opportunities opportunities. Um, you know, uh, on the pitching staff wise, every day wise, a couple of guys, you know, uh, try to reward them because, you know, they're out busting their tail like everybody else. And and, uh, and then we got, you know, quite a few injuries. So I think just giving a day off uh, a help and, and hopefully, you know, obviously we got a really long, thank God, last ever bus ride to Fort Smith, Arkansas. And, uh, even though I'm very good friends with their head coach, Todd, didn't mean anything personal about that. It's just a long ride. Um, anyway, uh, and and so we got a tough weekend and a huge weekend for us. Uh, you know, they're they're sitting close to the top of the standings, and uh, you know it's really jumbled. Uh, all it takes is one good weekend to turn everything around. So I feel like we're close. Hopefully this weekend then we get it going. All right, Coach, you know, overall y'all dropped the series, but you look at three of those games, and three of them, y'all were down, and y'all really rallied back, and y'all took one of them. 
You know, when this team gets hot, they have the ability to get 23 runs hot. Just talk about, are you wanting to maybe see them do that earlier in the game? Is that kind of what you're, you're not wanting to have them dig that hole, first that of all? That would be nice. Um, you know, and, and that's one thing. There is a little bit um, difference in intensity. Um, I don't know if that's the correct word, but, um, you know, having that sense of urgency from the first inning instead of we get punched. We're all, we've always been, ever since I've been here, we're great counter punchers. Um, but, you know, I don't know. We, we don't like starting the fight. We probably need to become bullies. And I don't know if you can say the word bully now, right? But <laughs> from a baseball standpoint, we need to be bullies. Thank you, Coach. Thank, Thank you, sir. Probably get